Hello everyone, my name is Maripal, so welcome to the Adjad Word Tutorial 5, Light and Shadows. So when you go on my page, down below on my page, you can see I added two Unity package. So Maritown, my first time Maritown, and Way Back Home, I already updated my Way Back Home, so kinda neat. So when you want to download, for example, you show like this and you press like here and you press, press on download that's it I already downloaded here same thing with the Maripal home kit or going back home you press again the same thing and you got those two unity package so let's get open this unity project so we're gonna create a project because we need to create light for sure and you can name it anything so that's one and let's just wait for a bit so we create a new project but we wanted to add my project on unity so first, let's get started with way back home. And it will take time to install, like importing all those materials. So let's just wait for a while. So I'm gonna press on import. After we added the first package that I added way back home, we're gonna have to add Maritown. So when you press it, it's take time. So you won't add the same package like VRC example and VRC SDK. So both of them are the same VRC SDK. So it won't um, make any conflict with the package. So they download the same package like I do. So let's import them. After you install correctly my both package on my Facebook page, this is how it looks like. Wow. First, we're gonna have to type with the one who have lighting and the one without lighting. So let's get started with the first one. All right, so this is my home kit way back home. Remember from the previous tutorial word? So this word has been upgraded. Pretty neat, right? So let's talk about the lighting. When you go on Windows, rendering, lighting settings you notice this is the skybox I use for the light at the background because I use this one do all my generate lighting so that's how I create my big light here wow sun source remember this one is a fake one because I want to troll you on that. Use the real light sense. This one is only for the light for the word. You see, curling mask default and not on the avatar. And this one is for the avatar. So the avatar, when you rotate, you see there is no shadows when you rotate like you see your avatar in dark color like it's pretty strange but now due of the light thing this is how your avatar can be nicely color you don't need to change anything here because remember generate light thing is already created by me so you don't need to change anything Second is this light. Remember to not always put the mode in real time because that's making life for VR user. Always put it on bake it. You don't need to add shadows because you don't need to create a lot of shadows on the floor. Also the curling mask I always put it on default 
for that one because if you put it for players it's made light but we already have a light the sun source you don't need to change anything here random mode I created for Maritown about the important and not important but let's put it on auto if you were having a light mapping you can go here press right click go to light and reflection prop you see it is a gray sphere but it's kind of neat but it's supposed to be a little bit editable for the light I pull it inside of this building just like this and then you will notice something even you have lighting you can also bake it it take one second and you see the light change it also one more thing is about the lighting you notice my sun when I try to change the color on the intensity doesn't do anything you have to go in lighting and use the intensity multiplier that's make brighter or darker on Maritown it would be different did this Maritown my avatar word did this the old version of this word so if we check on lighting the sun is in a good area nice you see the render mode is in important because this is our primary light but the problem don't add too much primary light you need to make it as a not important the color will change a little bit for the word but that's fine I like the way how it looks like now because if you add more important light you see it's too bright for your avatar or too bright for your word making sure you mix it everything so default player pretty good do we don't you generate lightning to have light maps I did three light so this light is also for avatar light let's test it I gonna to show you how it look like once you create um, the render mode one for important or two or more for not important you create uh, something to optimize in your word so VR user can join your word without any problem so that's how my word is running pretty well for quest user if it's having lags no one will join my word Five. 0.03 megabyte pretty neat not too heavy pretty good for testing some people adding too much stuff and it's making like taking time to generate your unity project to VR chat so this is how it looks like you see the shadows on the floor when I walking around is only just here if we try a standard avatar you see the alien have the right color when we rotate no dark skins or something like that or shadows or you know making dark your avatar look like a ghost but now it's pretty fine so you see the alien looks fine even we move around So that's pretty great. I'm going back to my avatar now. So that's how the light work on any words. You can put it important or not important or put it auto if you do light thing on your word. So thank you for watching this tutorial. Hope you have a great day. Bye bye.